Hey folks, I'm RJ Byrne and today in this wheat field I'm going to talk to you about some of the different stages of wheat growth and herbicide timing applications is really important to this also your fertilizer applications so for example I want to check this field and see if we are in the jointing phase and when we get to the joining phase that means that we need to start thinking um, do we have our herbicide application out is our nitrogen out and I know this year here in 2014 has been very difficult in South Carolina we've had a lot of wet weather can't get in the field and cold weather so this wheat crop is a little bit behind but let's talk to you about how to determine if your wheat is in the joining stage or not all right so one easy way to do is find your main stem so pull back tillers find your main stem and just feel on the wheat and what you do is you start at the base at the soil here and you start feeling if you've got a hollow stem and then a hard point which will be the growing point and then a hollow stem so for example this main stem here I pulled up it's hard down here but it's hollow up above so that means that this growing point is still down below towards the soil line and it has not started to reach the joining phase now this wheat main stem I pulled up here you can actually see that I cut open and on this main stem here you can see that that is actually the growing point right here and it has not yet reached the joining phase so for example uh, products like PowerFlex and even 2,4-D we want to spray um, especially 2,4-D you want to spray before this growing point gets above ground so still in the tillering phase, but by PowerFlex, we want to spray before this growing point hits the first joint. And that's very important. So be checking your fields and be scouting because we want to make sure we control things like this hen bit or even ryegrass, which fortunately I haven't seen too much in this field here, just a few spots here and there. But we want to make timely applications protect those chemistries and do a good job so we can maintain our high yields uh, for 2014 even though we are behind on our timing normally for this wheat crop. Hey if you got any questions feel free to contact me at the information below. Again my name is RJ Byrne and hope this video helps you out in scouting your wheat fields.